What's up everybody, it's that white boy from the yard and I'm back at it again with another video. As you can see, this time we're at the gym and I wanted to show you guys some tips and some training tactics when you train bicep in combination with tricep, aka supersetting, which means hitting a tricep exercise and immediately afterwards do a bicep exercise without rest. You rest after the tricep and the bicep exercise, okay? What I would do at first, I always start off with a cable extension for the tricep. Since I'm young, I wanna save my elbows and my joints. So I'm going to show you guys how I would do 12 reps just for the warm up of the elbows with the tricep cable extension. So I do this lightweight. I start off with lightweight on the triceps, then I build it up. I start off with heavy weights on the biceps, and then I build it off to lower weight to get maximum pumps. So first 12 reps of cable extension. There's no need to get the arms like this. 90 degree angle, this is, this is enough. This is the motion where you flex the tricep, okay? So not higher, not higher at all. Just 90 degrees lower, squeeze, 90 degrees, Lower, squeeze. You see, I hit the tricep really good. I do it for 12 repetitions, like I said. Just to warm up the elbow. Always breathe out. Breathe in, breathe out. So 90 degrees again. We immediately do bicep workout and like I said, I start the bicep workout really heavy, as heavy as possible and then I start slowly start building it off to lower weight to really focus on the pump but at first we will hit the biceps with a high, high weight. So I will do some hammer curls with uh, 18 kilogram dumbbells which is probably around 37 pounds. So I will do hammer curls for 12 repetitions with heavy weight 18 kilograms. So let's get it. One, one, one. Two, two, three, three, four, five. So now we rest. No 30 seconds, no 45 seconds, no one minute. I rest as long enough as my body needs. So when I think, yeah, I'm ready to do the set, if it's one minute, if it's three minutes, it doesn't matter. If I'm ready to do the set, I'm ready to do the set again. So I would do four sets from eight to 12 reps on the tricep extension to warm up the elbow with low weight. Then I do the same thing with biceps, but heavy weight. So I curl them up real heavy. That was the first superset. I will show you guys the second superset. So we move to the preacher girl machine. I like to switch things off. Sometimes I do it barbell, sometimes I do it dumbbell. Slowly down, not all the way down. You don't want to hurt the elbows and get it up to the top. Squeeze it. You don't want to get it all the way to here because you will lose the tension on the muscle. And time on the tension is actually really important to help the muscles grow. So slowly down, get it up, not too far up. And what I like to do is I like to, you know, twist the dumbbell in so you could really focus on creating that bicep peak. Squeeze it in, slowly out, pump it up, up. I can really feel the squeeze and the pump. So we're trying to focus on eight to 12 reps as well. Some lower weight, but perfect form. So again, we will do this four times, 
Start off with a tricep, single-handed dumbbell skull crusher. Then we go to the preacher curl, single-handed as well. Superset them. And then again, you wait till the body's recovered and you're able to do the next set, okay? So the next exercise up is for the triceps, which is actually a close grip barbell bench press, as you can see, is behind me. This will hit every angle of the tricep, all the three heads. So it's a really good movement to build that tricep strength and mass. And again, we up the weight for the triceps now, and then again, we lower the weight for the bicep. So with chest and triceps, and actually all kind of barbell movements, I use the suicide grip, so with thumbs under instead of over. I don't know, I could really get a better contraction while doing this. Also a good tip, suicide grip. Close, as you can see. Pulling it towards my body. I don't feel my chest, 90 degree angle, and I push out. And I don't push all the way out since we don't want to hurt the elbows. So slow down. Up. 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 So again, we will do this four times, tricep movement. Then we will do the bicep exercise, four sets of eight to 12 reps again. So next up on the list, I actually wanted to do some seated single arm bicep curls. Just the simplest bicep curls there are. And then I will really focus on the twist. So when you're sitting like this, you twist the wrist inside so you can create that contraction. You really try to create the peak in the bicep. And then when you lower it, you twist the arm back. Get it up, you twist it out the back in so now with weights 8 to 12 reps lower the weight focus on the pump So do this four times, eight to 12 reps. Try to up the weight, but don't forget when you're getting into the bicep exercises, you want to start lowering weight so you get high at first, start building off. And like I said, really focus on the contraction because the mind to muscle connection is really important to build muscle. Arnold Schwarzenegger said it, a whole lot of people said it. The mind is the strongest muscle in the body there is, so you gotta train it as well. If I wanna flex my muscle like this at this time and how I want it, when I want it, I should be able to do that. So the mind to muscle connection is actually really important, guys. You should actually be able to do the workout with your eyes closed you just want to feel what you're doing and that's the way you're doing it correctly okay okay the next exercise is tricep push down also with a cable just with a regular bar as you can see we'll try to focus on the outer head so i'm not pushing down like this like the regular i'm not do i'm not doing this what i try to do is i push my elbows out and then i push them down like this so I really get a different contraction, different angle and hit the outer tricep. So now we reach the point where we want to do heavy weights on the triceps. So we're not going to do it like this. We're going to stick the elbows out like this, almost to an uncomfortable situation and then push it down. As you can see, different contraction in the tricep. So stand close to the cable. Don't get the elbows up too high, push it down. Different angle as you can see. Since it's a cable exercise, I think you wanna focus on 12 reps, definitely. Maybe even 15. To really get the blood pumping into the muscles. So we want to do that in combination with another bicep exercise. All cable exercises will give you definition, okay? 
keep that in mind. So I always like to end with a cable exercise to get a nice condition. So, so I did a cable tricep right now. Now we will go to a bicep cable exercise. Okay, so now we reached the point where we want to do a lightweight for the biceps to really focus on the squeeze and the pump and to get a maximum effort out of the bicep training. I did heavy weights. I made good repetitions. So my biceps are done. I can't lift heavy weight anymore. So that's why I want to focus on the squeeze, the contraction and really create a nice peak. You kind of want to pull it behind your back. Don't stretch it all the way out. I like to focus on the pump. So kind of a little bit further than 90 degrees. Squeeze on top. Slowly out, squeeze on top. Slowly, squeeze. Slowly, squeeze. Then again, 12 to 15 reps, okay? Then again, we will do this four sets. So four times 12 to 15 reps. And then believe me, the pump is unreal. So by doing this, you get a three dimensional tricep. You will get a really intense pump in the bicep. Okay guys, so thanks a lot for watching. This was it for my first workout video. If you wanna see more, there's more to it. Don't forget to subscribe. I could do back workout, chest workout, shoulder whatsoever. I got lots of different bicep workout, triceps for every week, just to hit every angle, different every time. So thanks a lot, I appreciate it. Don't forget to subscribe. And if you have any questions, feel free to ask me. Go to my Instagram at whiteboyfromtheyard or on the Facebook that whiteboyfromtheyard.